What is going on guys? Grave here today. Let's talk about the different afflictions in game or the different status effects depending on what you want to call it. But these are things that can happen to your character and actually affect your character's health or oxygen overall. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course if you enjoy the video hit the like button. And if you have not subscribed to the channel yet, I hope you consider subscribing. Now when it comes to the different amount of things that can happen to you, Overall, there's 18 different status effects or afflictions that can happen while you're playing. So things like brain injury, burn, contusion, uh, concussion, dislocation, fracture, fractured skull, frostbite, heat stroke, hernia, hypothermia, infection, laceration, lung damage, poisoning, uh, puncture wound, radiation poisoning, or a torn muscle. Now, there are some ways that you can fix these uh, in-game, or well, actually two different ways that you can kind of cure these status effects or fix them uh, one being of course going to the doctor which will cost you 500 credits each time you go of course there is a doctor in New Atlantis which is one of the first big cities that you come to or you actually can patch them up yourself on the fly by using different items you pick up in game but for an example of something that could happen to you would be uh, if you got lung damage that would limit your oxygen and reduces how much you can sprint jump melee or you know poison will drain your health over time if you want to be able to check these status effects or if you're suffering for anything or your character is you can open the main menu and check in the prognosis section now if you're not wanting to maybe spend the credits each time something happens because strangely enough these things can happen kind of often especially if you're running around hopping around on the map uh, exploring the world sometimes you will end up spraining something hurting something or getting burned, poison, whatever the case could be. So, for example, if you have a brain injury, that's going to be an ejector or snake oil that can cure that if you have those on your character. For burns, that will be heal paste. For a concussion, that will be the injector or snake oil. For a contusion, that will be bandages or zipper bandages. For a dislocated limb, fractured limb, or fractured skull, you can use the immobilizer. For a heat stroke, a hernia, or hypothermia, you can use the snake oil or the injector. If you have an infection, you can use antibiotics. If you have a laceration, you can use bandages or zipper bandages. If you have lung damage or your poison, you can use the injector or snake oil. If you have puncture wounds, you can use bandages or zipper bandages. Uh, radiation poisoning, uh, you can use the injector or snake oil. Or a torn muscle, you can use the immobilizer. So if you come across things like injectors, snake oils, healing pastes, uh, zipper bandages, normal bandages, uh, immobilizers, Make sure that you're keeping those, either on your character or maybe keeping a good stockpile of them on your ship in your cargo hold. That way, you won't have to, you know, go out, be out doing something, being be out uh, maybe just kind of adventuring around on one of the planets, exploring, and something happens and you have to return back to your ship, then go back to, you know, a different planet where you can find a doctor to heal those. If you have these things with you, you can heal them, like I said, directly uh, from your character or maybe store them in your uh, cargo space on your ship like i said if you just make sure if you want to check for any of these uh different status effects in game you can go to that prognosis part by opening the main me main menu of the game and checking that out and show you how many injuries you've picked up and how severe they are anyway leave me a comment with your thoughts and of course if you like the video hit the like if you have not subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace